Hello friends, I am Mike with Views in our Sanaza office here and I'd like to share with you 10 steps that needs to happen to have a successful project that would be delightful for the customer, for the inspection and to comply with all the rules and regulations. So we will start with the first one. So the first step is the setback. Every time we go out, we need to make sure that the units that we install, whether it's a square unit or a slim unit that goes outside, it is not right next to your neighbor. So there is not noisy and uh, allowed by the city. So there is certain setback. It ranges approximately three to five feet and sometimes even further out. Number two is the clearance from electric panel. We cannot install anything right next to the panel. We have to have at least three feet to either side, to the left or to the right. So anything like that would comply with all the city regulations and would be safe. Number three is the noise level of the outdoor unit. Again, different cities in Bay Area have different regulations. Somewhat less, somewhat more. So on average, it's good to have a quiet unit outside that it's not as loud as around 60 dB. We have plenty of different units that would comply with the city regulations. Number four is the location of the outdoor condenser. So most of the time, I'd say 70% of the time, we usually install this in the back of the house. Sometimes it's on the sides if you have enough space, rarely in the front. So the location is important. Number five is we need to make sure your electric panel can support the new equipment. So what we do is we look at the breakers and we do the load calculation for your house. We check all the equipment like your ovens, your refrigerators, uh, anything like EV chargers and we make, we make sure like not, not everything connected to your electric panel at the same time. So we do the load calculation for that and provide it to the city. Number six is HOA approval, Homeowners Association approval. For those communities that live in multi-unit building or special units where you have the HOA board, we have to get the approval letter from them that we are allowed to install the equipment that you're interested in. Usually we handle all those processes. Once you approve the estimate, we would look at the requirements from the HOA and tell you what exactly needs to be done to get the approval from the HOA. Number seven are the rebates, even though it's not required to pass any inspections. We like to tell our customers about all the money the government provides us in order to subsidize the equipment and make it less expensive for installation. In fact, we obtain lots of rebates all the time from different programs. Once we do the estimate, we'll tell you which equipment would qualify for the rebate. Number eight is Home Energy Rating System. Shortly stands for Hearst Test. Once we complete the installation of the unit, we need to make sure all the duct work doesn't have most of the leaks and would comply with the city. So we would send a special, not from our company, independent inspector that would test your system for the leakage and give, give a report. We need this report in order to pass the inspection. Almost the last step is the city inspection. As you can see, we deal with many cities in the Bay Area. We have numerous inspections every day and uh, most of them we pass easily because all the work we do is like top quality. So we almost never have any problems. So that's when the city comes out. Our inspector usually comes at the same time and present during the visit and they would tell the inspector what was done at the project and uh, help them to mark off and pass your project and complete the installation. Number 10 is our long-term relationship with you. Once we complete the installation, we're not done. We're there for you because when you invest in us, we would like also to invest in your project. So if there is ever any problem, you would have originally, for most of the projects, three years labor warranty and also most of the equipment would come from 10 to 12 years parts warranty. If anything happens, we're there to take care of you. We have different recognitions for our good work and we would like always to stand by our customer and make sure you're happy. Thank you for watching. Bye.